but God wants you to ask. James 4 and chapter 2, or chapter 4 and verse 2 says this, you do not have because you do not ask. God, where's my miracle? God, where's my miracle? God, where's my miracle? God's like, I've been waiting for you to, for you to ask for your miracle. How important is prayer in all this? Again, Jesus says, look at verse 29. He says, this kind comes out only by prayer. So evidently the disciples were trying to get a miracle but do it without prayer. How crazy is that? That these disciples are like trying to get this, but they're not praying at all, but they're trying to get a miracle. I'm like, crazy disciples, like, man, Jesus, you should have picked a better 12 because these guys, they're not even praying, but they're expecting a miracle. And I'm like, I do that all the time. All the time. So many times in life, things are busting apart. Like I remember several years ago, I don't remember the situation. We had this financial thing that was happening and a bunch of other stuff that was going on. And I'm like frantically kind of freaking out. Like I need to do this and do this and do this and do this. And Steph just looked at me and she's like, maybe you should pray. And I'm like, you know what? Maybe I should. How is it that prayer is my last resort? The last thing that's on my mind and Jesus would just say this, I want you to ask me. I want you to ask me. And maybe God's not given a miracle because we're doing everything except asking him for one.